The North Londoners were due to move into their stunning £800 million arena next month after arranging beforehand for this weekend's Premier League clash against Fulham to be played at Wembley. The first game should have been a mouth-watering clash against Jurgen Klopp's Liverpool. Instead it could be November before Spurs are back at White Hart Lane due to critical safety system issues which have prevented test events needed at the new ground for a safety certificate to be issued. Fans who have prepaid for season tickets at the new stadium fuming, demanding refunds and compensation. Pochettino's men got an opening day victory at Newcastle, image, Getty Images Europe, Pochettino said, we need to be all together. We need our fans to understand that it's a massive, huge project that will be, there, forever for them in the club. If it's not possible for different things not in our hands, the most important thing is to be positive. Of course I understand the problems about the tickets, the money and everything, and I feel sorry for them. I want to say thank you and apologize. We are going to try to reward them by winning games. It's the only way we can add and can pay all the effort they are doing and they are going to do for the club, Spurs had initially hoped to return to White Hart Lane. Next month, Image, PA, no venue yet set for their October 28th clash against Manchester City and the club's Champions League home group games also set to be held back at the National Stadium. Pochettino's words echo those of Spurs chairman Daniel Levy who has been under fire after news of the shambles broke earlier this week. Pochettino backed Levy and urged fans to bear in mind the work put in by the chairman to try and get the club competing alongside the Premier League and European elite. Tottenham chairman Daniel Levy, image, Getty Images, he said, we all feel disappointed of course with the announcement from the club this week. I feel so sorry for myself first of all, for our fans, the players, everyone, and of course for our chairman. He tried with the board and everyone who is involved with building the new stadium to arrive on time. It's been a massive effort. We feel it every day, that effort. That we cannot deliver for the Liverpool game is massively disappointing for everyone. I understand that, but the first to be disappointed is Daniel. Our job is to try to help, to be positive, to adapt ourselves in the moment that we are going to play in our stadium. But now we are still going to play a few games more, Liverpool and Cardiff, that is sure. We hope we can finish all the work in that moment and start to play in our new home. If it's not possible I think we're going to try to give our best to try in the end to win games, to show good performance, being positive, never want to miss the latest transfer news or match reports. We've got newsletters sending you the latest from the football world or, more specifically, for Arsenal, Chelsea, Liverpool, Manchester United, FC Barcelona and Real Madrid. Sign up here to receive stories straight to your inbox.